So why should you be against animal testing? Each year, more than 115 million animals are killed during the process of animal testing. Animal testing is a very controversial topic that has been going on for many years. The first known use of animals in biomedical research dates all the way back to 500 BC in ancient Greece. During that time, it was very popular to practice acquiring knowledge on the functions of living organisms using animals. Animals and humans are very similar when it comes to their biological pro properties, which is why animal testing is so popular. But that does not make it acceptable to put the animals in these abusive environments. Although animals are biologically similar and susceptible to many of the same health problems as humans, only about 8% of the drugs tested on animals are deemed safe and effective for human use, while 92% are not. These statistics prove that animal testing is unreliable and that animal studies do not reliably predict human outcomes. Animal experiments have become so irrelevant that up to half of them never even get published, and the results of these irrelevant experiments only mislead the scientists and waste valuable resources such as money and time. So why do scientists continue to use animals in their research when all it seems to do is prolong the suffering of humans that are waiting for effective cures. Not many people stop and think about the inhumane things that the animals go through while they're in these situations. Most of the animals used for testing are deprived of water and even force fed sometimes. They're also physically restrained for long periods of time while they're being inflicted with pain. Most of the animals die during the tests that are being conducted on them, and the survivors are usually euthanized at the end of the experiments. These conditions are more acceptable because animals are regarded as property and have no legal rights of their own. It is important to remember that animals are living creatures, just like us, and they deserve to be treated with respect and dignity. Animal testing is proven to be pointless inhumane and cruel and humans are the only ones that can stop it some scientists still believe that animal experiments are the only ways to find cures and protect human health but that is not true there are many different alternative methods that can be used to test products without harming animals such as stem cell research non-invasive diagnostic imaging computational and mathematical models 3D tissue culture, and clinical research, including humans. Technology has evolved enough throughout the years to leave us no excuse to continue testing on animals in labs. The US Environmental Protection Agency announced in 2019 that it will stop conducting and funding studies on mammals by 2025 and it plans to end animal testing altogether by 2035. But that is over 10 years in the future. In my opinion, that's an unacceptable amount of time to allow these types of experiments to carry on. It's our responsibility as humans to speak for the animals and protect their rights the way they're not able to. If you're not sure how you could help or where to start when it comes to doing your part. You could start by buying only cruelty-free products, donating to a great cause regarding animal testing, or another way that's simple is leaving, planning to leave your body to science after you die. These are just a few examples of some of the simple things we could do to help save the animals one of the most easy, important, and effective ways to help the animals is to spread the word, spread awareness. Do your part by educating others on the issue of animal testing. The more people are made aware of this issue, the more of a chance we have at actually helping the animals. We are the only ones who can save the animals and it's time for us to take action. Thanks.